Hello there, this is another tutorial by me, Brothers Computer Tutorials. And if you may have noticed that I've had to change my YouTube channel name to iTech 63 due to copyright purposes that was brought up against me um, from Cantasia um, and well, TechSmith and other video and other companies. But now um, I've decided to make a whole new segment of tutorials, which I reckon you will find more satisfying and compelling than the other tutorials that I have previously made on my previous account. Um, what better way to start off a new channel with um, than with an Adobe Dreamweaver tutorial. So what we're going to be doing obviously is make building a website with Dreamweaver. This is very simple to do but this, this part of the um, tutorials is just the simple tricks that you can do in it. So first of all, what we'll need to do is get a template. So you can just go up to freecsstemplates.org and just click on CSS templates. So now what you want to do is just find a template that you want to use. Um, make it. Is, get, I'm just going to pick a basic one, which is this one I reckon. Yeah, this one looks alright. And download the zip file. Now you can open it up and extract it to your desktop and that is extracted now and on Dreamweaver you want to open it up where, where, um, once you've opened up Dreamweaver it says open you can just open up the fo folder you've just extracted make sure it's the index file and here it is right. I don't like this picture so what I'm going to do is um, if I can, um, well, I'm not going to do that at the moment. I'm just going to ch change the text to I comp, and I do not want actually. I'm going to have the slogan as here to help. Now what? So second, just write that again. Highlight all of this all of the text that you want to be edited like that oh, I'm just going to delete the slogan because I don't really want one in and up here this is what I do every time I make a website up in the title you just have to change it to the name of the page really so I'm going to go icon home page that's what I'm going to type in and if you want to preview it in your browser I'm just going to hit F12 and yes you have to save it if you notice it says icomp up here it says icomp home page so that was simple and if you want other pages in it I'm just going to save go file save as and first of all what's the first one products so if you have products dot html save it as that and I'll save it again and I want to save this as videos and save it on oh no, videos.html must save it as a HTML file right and so now here I need to change all of these every page I've got to videos otherwise you'll be clicking on services and it will be coming up with videos um, we do not want that if it's going to be a professional one videos okay so now file save all on every page now you need to change the title otherwise that will also make it look unprofessional so videos again and now we want to link up the pages so I'm going to highlight the home page click on the file file picture next to link and um, select index now where it says products just do the same keep doing the same all the way through until you've done every page 
So home. Oh, this sometimes does take a while. I don't really need to do the products page because that's the page I'm on. And you just keep going all of these. And we're almost done now. Okay, so we're done. Now I can preview it in my browser. So if I go to the home page, F12. It's best to save it all. Now if I go to products, if you notice, it's changed to products. Now if I go to videos, it's changed to videos up here. So, say now you want to add in a, into your videos, you want to add a YouTube video. So I could delete every single part of this. And first of all, I want to add in a channel. So, type in channel. and hit enter a few times. Now we're going to go onto YouTube. And it's more on YouTube. You m must have an account to do this, to add in your channel obviously. So you go onto your, where it says your name and account. Now you can go to custom video players, create a custom video player and it's going to be I text channel. Let's call it the first word in enter entertainment. And I want to have it match the video layout have matching this, the actual channel, the actual sites layout. So that looks about right. Um, yeah, looks good. Now I can generate the code, and here it is the embedded code. So I can copy all of this and go back to Dreamweaver. Now, with the cursor, select where you want the channel to appear and go up to the code view and just paste it in. As you met, as you can see, it's pasted in neatly. Now I can hit F12 and just preview it. And as you can see, it, I have not got any videos currently, so I've had to. This is my channel now, so it's ain't that cool. You can now add in um, some videos from YouTube. So if you want to do this. I just want to type in hope you enjoy nothing now enter a few times and go back to YouTube I'm gonna find a video from Radar's comp tutorials click on the head explosion I think and before it starts to play I'm gonna here next to it it should say embed and I do not want to include the related videos and um, this is the colour scheme I want now I can copy that embed code and paste it into the code view just as I did the channel so as you can see now if I hit F12 and save it I have this so say you want to have the embedded code just like here so what you could do is hit enter once and go to insert form text area and I'm just going to call it embed one and ok so now if you select that you can change the character width to any size you want and I want it to have one line like this and it's going to be a single line and I'm just going to paste that embedded code inside there so as you can see it's right here now if I hit F12 to preview it I can just copy all of this embedded code right here